Here's a video of our 2019 Platinum Stock Combo LQ trailer with a Outlaw, an Outlaw uh, Proline interior, two 20 pound propane tanks, aluminum battery box with two batteries, hydraulic jack, equalizer jack, continental spare, and tires. Uh, they're 17 and a half inch tires, load range J, believe. And yes, load range J. Uh, electric awning. Step at the living quarters door. Grab handle, porch light, two exterior speakers. This trailer has a hay pod. There are um, three air cracks with plexiglass. There will be simulators on these tires uh, after we get a wash and get everything detailed. Four exterior tie hooks on this side, the load light right in the middle. And uh, there's your platform for your generator. Uh, it's a 4,000 watt owning generator. Sorry for all the noise. We're right by the highway. Our uh, rear door has a slider. Inside, rubber mats on the floor. Um, real walls are also rubber lined. Two interior lights. Three roof vents. Uh, there's, this is your fuel, bot, your fuel tank for your generator, also rubber lined. Give you a better shot at that. This trailer also has um, a five foot, had to count, five foot sliding gate rail. So this gate with the slider, cut you with the slider, will move forward and backwards in one foot increments. Um, so you can use this front stall for just one horse or some storage if you want. There is an escape door and this um, sliding gate rail starts right behind that escape door. Show you that this way. Here's a view to the outside. ladder for your hay rack and hay, um, hay pod and generator access. Another low light on this side. Scoop door. And then just a peek up towards the front. We'll go through um, this mid tack. It's a nice large four foot door. Has a four tier swing out blanket bar on the door. This saddle rack also swings out outside. Attack. So you can stay there for me. Just kind of sitting on an angle. And I'm using one hand. So that is on this side. There's also a large step here at the mid tag door. Walk through door into the living quarters. We did carpet on the bulkhead wall. So it'll keep your bridles quiet as you're traveling down the road. There's also an interior light in here and three shelves and storage below. These mats are curled up in protest to the Indiana winter cold, and so am I. This uh, mid tack also has rubber on the floor because that's just a lot easier to keep clean. And if you want to just slide this back, I don't know if I can do it one-handed. Uh, wasting all your video time. There we go. So that just sits in here like that when it is um, in place. So you can see that as well. There's also a five foot clothes rod uh, if you wanted to hang some shirts or coats or whatever else we um, bring with us. So inside this mid tap, it's kind of handy to have that too. Here is a look at the interior. Come into the bathroom, there's nice storage uh, to two clothes rods in there, full length mirror. There's also a um, really nice size uh, vanity with some great storage and some depth to that as well. It's nice and big. Sink is nice and wide. The faucet comes up nice and high. Great storage under here. This is an all solid wood interior, very well made. We'll hold up for a nice, you know, long time. This interior has a one-year warranty. There 
is a um, power fan and lid to that fan. Shower. And then here's a peek at the moving area. Nice size fridge and freezer. Storage above. That's one great thing Outlaw does. They have storage just in every area. Nice closure on that. Keep it closed going down the road. There's for your uh, gray and black tanks. Oh, this tells me I'm running out of power, so I'm going to go quick. Um, two more more closet storage here, full length. Two hat racks. There's your screen door. This is your kitchen area. Nice size drawers, nice and deep. Storage under here as well. Nice little cubby here. Nice size sink, microwave, TV, uh, DVD player, radio. There's interior speakers in here. There's your wardrobe and the great feature. This also has a drop down bunk. Let's see if I can get it one handed. This flips up and then um, these two mattresses come down. Another thing too is this mattress is a nice good size, very soft, um, not chintzy mattress. So that's nice as well. This sofa also folds out into a bed. So you have your bunk above, which you can take those, uh, the mattress out of there and use that for storage behind there if you don't need the extra sleeping space. And then your sofa, uh, all the windows have day and night shades on them in the nose and in the, um, right there by the sofa, a snap cover on the door so you don't have light coming in there. Here's your panel for your generator, start switch, your awning switch up above. Um, you have outlets as well as um, plugs for your cell phone. And then I should have showed you a little bit more under here. Um, your nice lights. So here's a quick little tour too before I run out of um, power. They just don't last long enough in this cold weather. Great storage up there too. Just a really nice interior. Great options on the trailer. Very versatile um, in both areas. So if you have any other questions, please let us know. We're happy to take more video or more pictures. Uh, Stovetop here is also has a glass cover so it's flush. Um, and so you have extra counter space too. I feel like that was a whirlwind speed video, but I hope you get a good idea of what it looks like. This TV is also on a swing arm, so you could rotate it out this way or towards the bed. And here's your switches for your two outside speakers. And then there's also some storage below here, below your step, too. And some storage under the couch. Mostly the water tank, but a little bit in the front of it. Okay. 